Hey everybody, welcome back to Running on Empty Food Review. Nah, I'm just playing, but I'm here with Zach. Hey. <laughs> and uh, he told me about this place. It's a little bit in town, and apparently the burrito is massive. So I thought I would go check it out and see what's going down. Is it actually that big? See, his hands just keep getting bigger every time he tells me the story, which is why I don't believe him for a second. But we're going to go check it out. I thought it would be a cool video to go see it. So we're going to go pick it up, bring it back to the house, put it on the table, and slop down on it. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Zach. Here it is, the Anaconda Burrito. Zach, come over here, show them the crazy burrito. Look at the size discrepancy. Uh, line it up. Look at this. Look at the difference here. You, this is the crazy burrito. That's pretty big. I mean, that's like the size of my chest. That's probably a good 20 inches. I don't actually know the size of my chest, but 20 inches, 25 inches. I mean, 40 inch pythons, you could probably, uh, we ain't gonna look at all that right now, but. You can tell the difference. Now, we're gonna open it up so I can show you the beauty of this burrito. Oh my God, it's tripled up on, look, bring the camera over here, bring it over here. Look at this burrito. This thing is a monster. That is tripled up layers like you've never seen. Look inside, you got beef, you got your lettuce, you got your tomatoes, you got your French fries. You got your rice, you got your beans. Oh my God. This is an easy seven to eight minute meal for me. So this is the crazy burrito. This is probably the, I guess the little sister of the beast, the anaconda. Definitely more structurally sound though. Absolutely. I think uh, once you hit a certain size, it's just, it's just too big, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, that, mm -hmm. it's, just, it's just too big sometimes. So I think maybe if it went like a solid four inches, that would be, I think that's enough for most people. Open, open it up, let's see what's inside. Yeah, I don't know how to do this. Oh. You're good, you're good, you're good. So yeah, it's about, it's a little sister. You see, you got your, you, but you didn't get ground beef. I got the barbacoa. Barbacoa with the French fries, the lettuce, the tomato, the rice, the beans, the goods. I don't know, how, I don't know how to start eating this. You want a knife? Hell no, what do you think I am? I think I can split it up. Whew, I don't know. I don't know what to do in this scenario, but we ass in 28. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> Definitely not the most structurally sound burrito, but that is pretty damn. So, the Anaconda Burrito, the Crazy Burrito. The Anaconda Burrito, how much do you think, stop the video after I say these words. How much do you think this burrito was? Did you think it was $5? You're wrong and you're stupid. What do you, get your, what, go to school. $10? Not even close. $13.99? Maybe for the little man over here. It, satisfi it satisfies some people, but for most, it's not doing enough. $24.99. $24.99. You pay for the girth. You really can't ask for more when, you, when you're craving a burrito. You go bigger, you go home. Crazy burrito, it was good. I've had it before, but it's just not enough. So thank you guys for watching this. I decided to just do this out of the blue here with Zach because he told me about this big ass burrito. I wanted to see it for my eyes and I see it and I'm about to eat this whole thing. So thank you guys for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. I don't know where to look because I've never recorded with my cell phone like this before. So hey, uh, if I was looking at the stop button the whole time, that's my bad. But anyways, remember to leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you guys are not subscribed for more of that goody goody. And I'll see you next time. See you.